Amen. All right, don't forget the time you gave me the mic. Oh, it's 12 12. Uh -huh. So when it's going over, then you'll be crying. <laughs> Hallelujah. Praise is sweet. Amen. But we'll try and knock it out fast by the Spirit of God. So that the purpose of the sermon will come to pass. Hallelujah. There's a purpose for every crusade. There's a purpose for every sermon. Hallelujah. So as we get into the sermon, I pray that that's what will come to pass after now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Let's appreciate our Father in the within. Amen. Let's appreciate our Mother in the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. God, God bless her. God empower her in Jesus' name. Amen. Now appreciate yourself too. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. All right. So please, Holy Spirit, come and take control. I decrease myself, increase yourself in me. Use me as a vessel this day to break your word into pieces like bread and butter to your children here and whoever come across this video in the name of Jesus. I ask that you speak your mind to your people. I ask that through the sermon, let chains break, let shackles break, let curses be nullified. Through this sermon, release your blessings, release your favor over your children in the name of Jesus. Come and do what only you can do and receive the glory. I ask that speak through me. Use me as your oracle in the name of Jesus. Release my tongue. Let your own adulterated word come with fire and power and let it come out in its entity in the name of Jesus. Any powers in here online, wherever they are, that will try to obstruct, interrupt your word, thou that seest in darkness as in daylight, I ask that you move on our behalf and smite them by thunder in the name of Jesus. We ask that we not leave here the same way we came. In the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. It's a pleasure to see you all. God bless you. Hallelujah. Turn to your neighbor. Say, neighbor, you're shiny. You're shiny. You're going to be shining after now. You're going to be shining more, more, more after now. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Beloved, we are in the second half of the year. This is the first week of the second half, which is June um, 5th. Hallelujah. Amen. June 5th. Amen. And it's so important that we usher ourselves very well into the second half. Hallelujah. Amen. So today's service... It's called Abba Father Service. Abba Father Service is declarations and decrees. When the government decrees an act, everybody follows it. When they said everybody should put on mask, we were all doing that. When they say no more mask, you then see people without mask. So is it in the spiritual Hallelujah. According to Job 22, verse 28, thou shalt also decree a thing, and it shall what? Come to pass. So that's what we're going to do to usher ourselves into the second half of the year 2020. Somebody shout, Hallelujah. hallelujah. Amen. Please bring your Bibles with me to the book of Nehemiah, chapter 6. We're going to read from verse 3 to 8. Nehemiah chapter 6, from verses 3 to 8. Amen. So I sent messengers to them with this reply. 
I am carrying on a great project and cannot go down. Why should the work stop while I leave it and go down to you? Four times they sent me the same message and each time I gave them the same answer. Then the fifth time Sambalat sent his aid to me with the same message and in his hand was an unsealed letter in which was written, it is reported among the nations and Geshem says it is true that you and the Jews are plotting to revolt. Somebody say lie. And therefore you are building the wall. Moreover, according to these reports, you are about to become the Akin. Somebody say lie. And have even appointed prophets to make this proclamation about you in Jerusalem. Somebody say lie. There is a king in Judah. Now this report will get back to the king. So come, let us meet together. Eight, I sent him this reply. This is Nehemiah talking. Nothing like what you are saying is happening. You are just making it up out of your head. Hallelujah. Let's all say nothing like. This is happening. You are just making it up. Out of your head. Our sermon today is entitled Focus. Arise and shine. Focus to arise and shine. Focus to arise and shine. Hallelujah. In Isaiah 60, from verse 1 to 2, it says, Arise, shine, for your light has come, and the glory of the Lord rises upon you. See, darkness covers the earth, and thick darkness is over the peoples. But the Lord rises upon you, and his glory appears over you. Nations will come to your light and kings to the brightness of your dawn. Say, my father, my father, my father my let father. nations come to my rising and kings come to my dawn. In the name of Jesus. Our sermon today again is entitled, Focus to Arise and Shine. Hallelujah. In Hebrews chapter 11 verse 8, it says Jesus Christ is the same yesterday and today and tomorrow. Which means that what Jesus did yesterday, he can do the same thing today and he can do the same thing tomorrow. So why are you not experiencing the grace of Jesus? Why? In Matthew 17, verse 6, what does it say? It says, because ye have what? Little faith. If you have faith, you will say to the mulberry tree, move, and it will what? Move. Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Why is things not moving on your behalf? It's because ye have what? Little faith. But today, in the name of Jesus I came to push you to, to a greater faith. Hallelujah. Amen. I came to dare you stimulate your faith after now in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. The master seed, faith. Hallelujah. Amen. Jesus mentioned the mulberry tree that if your faith, you can have faith like a master seed, you will ask the mulberry tree to move and it will move. The mulberry tree is a tree that when it's growing, you might have seen it before back home. It, it goes deep down and it spreads its roots. You see those trees that the tree is here, but the roots are over there, over there, over there, deep down. 
So Jesus used this mulberry tree as an example that regardless of how deep the problem is, regardless of what's going on in your life, regardless of how global the issue is, like a mulberry tree root, by faith you can ask that root to come out and it will move in the name of Jesus. Today I came to decree and declare over somebody at the sound of my voice. It no matter what the problem is, that problem is uprooting. I said that problem is uprooting. I said that problem is uprooting in the name of Jesus. If you have faith, you will tell the uh, the mulberry tree to move and it will move. So shall it be in the mighty name of Jesus. Faith is very important in your focus. It is very important if you are a child of God and you need to arise and shine. You need faith. You cannot arise and shine without focus, without faith. Hallelujah. The place where we read regarding Nehemiah, Nehemiah went back to Jerusalem to rebuild the ruins of his fathers. And he had three distractors. Sambalat, Tobiah, and Geshem. Discourages, distractors, evil people. They tried to discourage Nehemiah. But the good news is, when you confront a problem at the place of prayer, when God gives you the go-ahead, it doesn't matter the confrontation of hell. It will not stand in the name of Jesus. Amen. Nehemiah had dealt with this problem at the place of prayer already. He fasted, he prayed, and God opened those doors for him. But our focus is on how did he do it. He had these people discouraging him. They sent a message to him Four times and the fifth time to come, to leave whatever he's doing to come to them. Hallelujah. This was manipulation from hell. Because they know that if they go and say, stop what you are doing. Stop the work. Stop doing the work of God. Stop doing what you are doing. It, it will just be too plain. They will look very bad. And so they cooked up a story and sent people to tell him to come. And told him, tried to intimidate him that, oh, you want to become the next king, right? We have heard about it. Uh, you are building the wall so that you, uh, you have appointed prophets, praise the Lord, to, 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 for, for you to be the boss after now. They said all kinds of stuff. Nehemiah knowing who he was, told them that all of these things you are saying, they are all what? Lies. Beloved, first of all, for you to arise and shine, you have to be focused. When you are focused and the enemy is making all kinds of allegations against you, you yourself will know that this is an what? allegation because you are not doing it so i came to submit to you god wants you to arise and shine according to isaiah 60 from verse 1 to 3 but it is up to you also to do your part hallelujah you need to focus sambalat tobiah geshon they tried so very hard nehemiah told them I cannot stop what I am doing to come to you. I am too busy. A lot of us, we call ourselves children of God. Every little distraction, we move. Hallelujah. A little distraction from church to church. Omega OFM to MFM to ICGC to you name it. No focused. Looking for the same God. 
Hebrews 11:8 he's the same yesterday, today, and forever. He's the same God everywhere. Omnipotent, omniscient, omnipresent everywhere. And I have noticed from my little experience, those moving from church to church is the same because they have not dealt with themselves to know that it is me, it is not in the church. Hallelujah. It is me, it is not in the name of the church. It is not in the pastor. So, lo and behold, give them time. By the time you hear that they are in OFM, you will see where they will be next. By the time they are in next, you will see where they were. And all apologies to any other part. I'm just preaching. Hallelujah. I'm just, I'm just making an example. Friends, your destiny is in the hands of God and yourself. Hallelujah. And one thing that you need to grab what God has said concerning you is your focus. Turn to your neighbor. Say, neighbor, neighbor. Say, focus. 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 So that you can walk into your destiny. In the name of Jesus. In Romans chapter 10 verse 17, it says, So then, faith cometh by hearing, and hearing by the word of what? God. So if you are not hearing the word of God, how does faith come? You are sitting home accusing everyone of being your mistake. Everyone, you that you have your life. Everyone is the person doing your mistake. There are people that don't even know where you stay. There are people that don't even have your phone number. There are people that have never even to talked to you or seen you live. How can that be their fault? Your life is in your own hands. Hallelujah. Receive the grace to focus after now. I say receive the grace to focus after now. In the name of Jesus. The will of God for your life is to arise and shine. Period. Otherwise he will not give his precious child. The only begotten son for us. Am I talking to somebody? That is his will. It is sin that has made us falling short of his glory. If you move from one place to another and you are still in sin, God that will not change the scriptures because of you. And so his, his will, his precepts remain the same. It no matter even if you move to Jerusalem and you are the same person, nothing changes. I pray for you today that after now, you will have a heart of repentance. I say you will have a heart of repentance. Amen. And you receive the anointing to focus Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. If Nehemiah was not focused, that assignment that he had with all the favor he received from the king and his wife, he, it would have been what? A waste. It would have been a total waste. A lot of you, you have received favor. You have received provision. You have received almost what you, enablement, power, almost what you need to continue your assignment. But you are distracted. Distraction has become your portion. How does distraction come? Distraction, distraction comes when there is no purpose. When there is no purpose, a person is distracted. Because it says when purpose, Miles Moreau said it, when purpose is not known, abuse is what? Inevitable. Which is so very important that before you give something to somebody, check their purpose. Check their motive. See whether they are matured enough to take it. Otherwise, abuse is not your fault. It's going to be so. Hallelujah. So it's so very important. In this second half, God wants you to arise and shine. But also you have to know the ways to sustain your rising. It's so very important. Say anointing. anointing. 
to sustain my rising. Follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me. In the name of Jesus, anointing to sustain my rising. Follow me. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. It is the will of God for every child that has been bought by the precious blood of Jesus to inherit that his that heritage it is his will the same blood that was shed on calvary is the same blood that purchased everyone and the purpose of the blood is what is to cleanse save restore you it will bring you back to his presence and so if you are not there Start working to be there. Don't be blaming people. Hallelujah. Don't blame people for what, what for your irresponsibility. You need to be responsible for your life so that you can enjoy the heritage that God has predestined for us. Hallelujah. It is also the will of God to see us walk in power is so very important. When you see people walk in power, do not envy them. You can also walk in power because the scriptures is not written and hidden in one country that only the people that have access to this scripture will walk in power. According to Acts chapter 1 verse 8, when ye have received the Holy Spirit, ye shall what? Power. So he say ye, or he says the people from Ghana, the people from now, he say ye, everyone. Hallelujah. And so his will for us is to walk in power. The people that don't know the scriptures, those are the people that criticize men and women of God that walk in power because they don't even know that they own it. You own it. You own the power of God. You own it. It's yours. Hallelujah. Receive power after now. I say receive power after now. I say receive power after now. In the name of Jesus. This is his will. He made it available, the Holy Spirit. Praise the Lord. So for you to arise and shine, you need to walk in power. By walking in power, you are walking with the who? The Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. A lot of us want to walk with power, with evil spirit. Manipulation, lies, confrontations, all the dirty spirit. It is not going to be possible. Turn to your neighbor say, change, 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 change. 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 It is so easy to walk in power. You snap your God. God is by you. It's just like a good child with a father. They turn daddy. Daddy say yes. In fact, the child will not not call. Daddy knows the GPS. He has put GPS on the spirit of the child already to know whether they are in their bedroom or they are in the couch or they are in the porch. Hallelujah. I pray for you today that after now you will walk in power. Amen. I say you will walk in power. Amen. I say you will walk in power. Amen. I say you will walk in power Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Another will of God for your life is to what? Minister. Is to preach the gospel to people around the nations. I know a certain pastor he has all the degrees. Anytime he gets a job, one or two weeks, he will lose the job. Not because he didn't have the degree, so. It's because that's not what God has predestined him to do. He did not understand it. He will fight, 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 fight. Get another job and then lose it again. Praise the Lord. Get another one and then lose it again. What is God telling you? What you are looking for is not where I have sent you to. Just, just like Jonah. Hallelujah. It's not where, what? You have been sent to. I came 
to submit to you somebody hearing the sound of my voice. Today, the will of God for you is to spread the gospel. Is to minister to people. Matthew 28 verse 19. Hallelujah. It is his will that we send the gospel to nations. And verse 20 says what? He will be with you till the end of age. Where is the scripture that says obedience is better than what? Sacrifice. A lot, a lot of us think we are walking in obedience, but we are walking in total disobedience. And any time you walk in disobedience, please expect what you get. Am I talking to somebody? But I pray for you today. I pray for you today. Open your palm. Open your palm. Open your palm in the name of Jesus. I connect to the throne room of grace. And I ask for the anointing for you to spread the gospel fall on you. I said anointing for you to preach the gospel fall on you. Anointing to evangelize fall on you. In the name of Jesus. Jesus said, you'll be witnesses unto me in Jerusalem when you have received power. Receive that power Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. So our declaration today is that you arise and shine for the second half of this month in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Now, we're going to do the declaration, but I also want to bring you another picture story in the bible in the book of second kings chapter 2 from verse 3 down please focus please focus else i'll change your position praise the lord in the book of second kings chapter 2 verse 3 down hallelujah you realize that the company of the prophets at bethel came out to elisha and asked do you know that the Lord is going to take your master from you today? Elisha said what? Yes, I know. Elisha replied, so be what? Quiet. So be quiet. That's focus. Despite he knows, he, the, the thing was going to affect him. But he told them to be what? Quiet. You need to focus to arise and shine. A lot of us, we are too chubby, 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 chubby. We're too, nobody will ask us any questions. We will just stand up and be explaining ourselves. We are not even preaching, no. You don't need that. You don't need that to arise and shine. Am I talking to somebody? God cannot talk to talkatives. You, that person will be the most frustrated Christian ever. If nobody told you, I'm telling you today, one of the keys of a high caller is quietness. If God tells you to talk, you talk. If you are talking, how can God talk? Am I talking to somebody? Yes. Elisha vehemently told them, I know, but be quiet. A lot of wars, can, battles can be won by being quiet. And one of the battles was Elisha's battle. He was quiet, but the mantle of Elijah did what? It fell on him. Hallelujah. How? Focus. Focus. He was focused. Despite the pain of his, his mentor, Elijah, Elijah's pain, or people say he's stingy, but I, I think Elijah was also more focused. I wouldn't say he's stingy. I think he was very focused. Huh? Hallelujah. Because even Papa preached something that there are people that when you bring them in your midst, they have bad head. So Elijah was making sure that Elijah didn't have bad head. To stop him from ascending into heaven. Hallelujah. And so he said, eh, this mantle is what is taking me to heaven. That's the double portion you want. Well, wait, watch, and see. If you if drops on you, then it's for you. Hallelujah. Amen. Elijah was focused 
Elisha was focused. Because Elijah was focused, Elijah's assignment came to pass. It came to pass because there are people that when they are following you, all they are looking for is the mantle to snatch it and then go their way. Yes, Elijah's focus made him go where? To heaven. Am I talking to somebody? Elijah's focus as well made him, you need to be focused. Stop being distracted. Hallelujah. Stop paying attention to what people are saying. The group of company of prophets, they were saying a lot to him. He didn't pay attention. I came to submit to you. I don't know who I'm talking to. But after now, receive the grace that made great men. The grace to focus. Receive it. Let it fall on you. Amen. I said the grace to focus at work. Focus in your family. Amen. Focus on your marriage. Amen. Focus on your ministry. Amen. Focus on your finances. Focus at work. Let it fall on you in the name of Jesus. Some of us have lost promotion because of the spirit of defocus. Without knowing that at that time we were doing it to ourselves. When you move from your cabin to another person's cabin to go and gossip. You, we, at that time, it was sweet. It was fulfilling. But when the backslash come, you realize that, damn it, this thing has hurt me. If you focus, they give you your cabin, you sit, you do your job. That doesn't mean don't be nice. But be professional. Do what you have to do. And then you go. Hallelujah. Receive that grace after now. Amen. I say receive that grace after now. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. You will not be distracted again. Amen. I say you will not be distracted Amen. again. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Please stand. Bible says in Proverbs chapter 4 verse 18. The path of the just is like a shining light that shines brighter and brighter unto a perfect day. Nobody made this up. This is what the scriptures say. So that thing you are looking for, what you need is a just path. Hallelujah. Amen. So, would you rather be unjust and lose your promotions, or you rather be just and enter into your breakthrough. Hallelujah. Amen. Receive the grace to be a just person. Amen. I say receive that grace. Amen. After now, you'll be a just person. Amen. Bible says the path of the righteous is like a shining star, shining brighter and brighter unto a perfect day. A righteous person is a just person. Hallelujah. Whether the person is there or not, you tell the truth. If you don't know, don't make it up. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If you don't, it doesn't even matter how you, whether you like the person or not. Because of your bright star, because of your path, because of your future, because of your, your, your life, I will not let you uncircumcisedly come and spoil my own, it will not happen. Hallelujah. It will not happen. You are blessed and highly favored, but also you have a portion to play so that you can enter into that blessing. It, it, there is no other way. You cannot arm twist God. You cannot manipulate God. You just have to follow the scriptures and that's what is going to be for you. I decree that your paths will shine after now in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. In Matthew chapter 5 verse 16, it says, Let your light so shine before men that thou may see your good works and glorify your Father. Let your light so shine before men that thou may see your good works and glorify your Father. Another criteria for your star to shine after now in this second half is what? Good works. What translation is this? Is what? 
good works. works, good deeds. Let your light so shine before men that thou may see your good deeds. We have a lot of Christians walking around with bad deeds, hoping to see blessings. You are a spiritual thief. That, that's not, uh, it's not going to be our portion. Am I talking to somebody? Amen. It will not be our portion. Yes. We, the Bible says we should work out our salvation with fear and trembling. Why do you think all those scriptures are there? They are there so that we will follow them to what? Into our heritage. Am I talking to somebody? Yes. Raise up your right hand of fire. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Anointing. Anointing. To work out my salvation. To work out my salvation. Let it follow me. Let, Let it follow me. In the name of Jesus. Anointing to work out my salvation. Let it follow me. Let it follow on the church. In the name of Jesus. We need it. Open it. Our mouth in Jesus' name. Amen. So we are going to de decree and declare. Hallelujah. As we say it, so shall it be. You, do you believe it? In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Raise up your right hand of fire. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. O God of Abraham. O God of Abraham. God of Isaac. God of Isaac. God of Jacob. God of Jacob. According to Job. According to Job. Chapter 22. Chapter 22. Verse 28. Verse 28. It says. It says. Thou shall also. Thou shalt also decree a thing, decree a thing, and it shall come to pass. And it shall come to pass. Jehovah Adonai. Jehovah Adonai. In this second half, in this second half of 2022, of 2022, let what I decree, let what I decree, and declare, and declare, according to your will, according to your let will, them be established. let 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 them be established. Open your mouth and pray in the name of Jesus. Let whatever I decree and declare in this second half of 2022. My Father, my God, in the name of Jesus, let whatever we decree and declare, let it be established. Your word says, Thou shalt also decree a thing, and it shall be established in the name of Jesus. Rika sukata ta ta leka tu kusaka ta rakusa ka te 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 rakase ka da 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 in Jesus name Isaiah 60 verse 10 to 22 Hallelujah Praise the Lord keep standing Hallelujah Amen Isaiah 60 verse 10 to 22 Hallelujah verse 10 and the sons of the strangers shall build up the walls, and their kings shall minister unto thee. For in my wrath I smote thee, but in my favor have I had mercy. NIV. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Chapter 10. We are going to take it chapter by chapter to 22, please. Hallelujah. 
chapter 10. Foreigners will build your walls and their kings will serve you. Though in anger I struck you, in favor I will show you compassion. Raise up your right hand of fire. Yes, Lord. First of all, you are going to ask for mercy. Yes, Lord. So that all these decrees will come to pass in your life. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Oh God of Apostle Johnson Suleiman. Oh God of Apostle Johnson Suleiman. This afternoon as I pray. This afternoon as I pray. I come just as I am. I come just as I am. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. By the blood of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. Forgive my sins. Forgive my sins. Forgive my trespasses. Forgive my trespasses. Open your mouth in the Le name of Jesus. My father, my father, in the name of Jesus. Show us mercy in the name of Jesus as we decree and declare. Let it be so. 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 In Jesus' name. Amen. Raise up your right hand of fire. Say, God of Abraham. God of Abraham. God of Isaac. God of Isaac. God of Esther. God of Esther. This day. This day. First Sunday. First Sunday. Of the second half of 2022. Of the second half of 2022. Show me favor. Show me favor. And show me your compassion. And show me your compassion. Open your mouth. Katu shatu katu ya. Le katu shataya. Le katu katu ya. Le kuta 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 Se kate ka so ba ka su ka ta ka te e ka don da ya ba don sha le ge de e le ge da la ga da la ga da la ga da show us mercy show us your compassion in the name of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus ma ko so te 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 ra ko so ka te 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 ma ka so ka ta 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 le ka so ko to to ka in Jesus name. 6011. It says, Your gates will always stand open. They will never be shut. I decree after now your gates will stand open. I say, I decree after now your gates will stand open. And your gates will never be shut. Whether day or night. Your gates will stand open Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Any man or woman that will try to interrupt your gate or stand at your gate to disadvantage you, they go down Amen. for your sake. I said they go down Amen. for your sake. Wherever gate, your marital gate, ministerial gate, business gate, your work gate, your life gate, your family gate, academic gate, any man or woman that will try to stand at the gate of your life, they go down after now in the name of Jesus. I said they go down after now in the mighty Amen. name of Jesus. Raise up your right hand of fire. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. As I pray right now, as I pray right now, let my gates, let my gates always stand open. Let them stand, stand open. open. Stand Just open. pray like stand that in the Lord. name of Jesus. Oh let my stand gates open always stand Lord, open. Mention the gates. Command it to open. open. Stand my open by fire by force. No man can change it. Mago Zandayaba, Aliga Doso Lugoda, Marka Suntayaba Dante, Aleketa Lebeze Leketa Legede, Magandi Abadanta Abazanta, Elegeze Legede. 
open my gates. Let my gates stand open day or night. It doesn't matter the opposition. It doesn't matter what they think. In the name of Jesus, let my gates, gate of ministry, gate of business, family gate, Marita gate, the gate of my children, the gate of my life and destiny, my financial gate, gate of healing, all gates that you have opened unto us. Let them stay open. 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 In the name of Jesus. The Lord is opening somebody's gate right now. I say the Lord is opening your gate right now. Your gates are opening right now in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. There's someone here. Your financial gates are opening. I say your financial gates are opening right now. In the name of Jesus. There's someone here. Your academic gates are opening. I say your academic gates are opening. Right now in the name of Jesus. There's someone online. Your ministerial gates are opening. Your ministerial gates are opening. In the name of Jesus. So shall it be in the mighty name of Jesus. And it says, people may bring you the wealth of nations. Their kings led in triumphal processions. Raise up your right hand on fire. Remember, Bible says that the wealth of the Gentiles shall be transferred to the righteous. Hallelujah. Amen. Raise up your right hand on fire. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In this second half of 2022. In the second half of 2022. Let the wealth of the Gentiles. Let the wealth of Gentiles. Be transferred unto me. Be transferred unto let me. Let the wealth of nations. Let the wealth of the Be nations transferred unto be me. Be transferred to me. Unto my family. Unto my family. Unto all that concerns unto me. All that concerns unto my loved ones. Open your mouth and pray. Yeah, bullshit. in Jesus name 12 it says, for the nation or kingdom that will not serve you will perish. Mm. It will be utterly ruined. Aha. Who are you? Ne Who are you? Who are you? A ah, child of God. A child of God. Ma he made you in his, in his image. For the nation or the kingdom that will not serve ah. you will perish. Yes, yes. Anyone yes, yes. that will not serve God. Absolutely. Hallelujah. Please. Don't go near. We have people that say, I have superpower. Hallelujah. They can't change me. They can. They can. Unless you, you, too, you invoke your superpower. When you are listening to bad music, you will not know when you, too, you start doing azonto, azonto. Hallelujah. Am I kidding? Hallelujah. It's so very important at this end time that you align yourself with the will of God. Anyone that will not serve God, pray for them, but love them from afar. Love them from afar, because Satan can, is using anyone now, anyone that will avail themselves. He's using them, minus you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Minus you in the mighty name Amen. of Jesus. Raise up your right hand of fire. Some people are locked up spiritually. I'm going to break yokes right now. Uh -huh. I feel it. Uh -huh. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Any power Le present in here uh -huh. that has been locked in satanic incubators uh -huh. that they will never serve God aright. Uh -huh. That spirit breaks right now. Amen. That spirit breaks right Amen. now. That spirit breaks right Amen. now. I command you to exit this door. Amen. You foul spirit, exit. Amen. Exit. Amen. Exit. Amen. Exit. Amen. Exit Amen. right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Raise up your right hand of fire. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As we begin to pray. As we begin to pray. Let me 
let be be a blessing be a blessing in your kingdom in your kingdom Open your mouth. Father, in the name of Jesus, let me serve you. Let me serve you and be a blessing. Let me serve you, serve you, serve you, serve you and be a blessing. That's the will of God for our lives. Let me serve you. In the name of Jesus, and be a blessing. In the mighty name of Jesus, Mark, anoint me to continue to serve you regardless. So I'll be a blessing to nations. I'll be a blessing to Anyone that you have called, Marco them. Anoint me to be a blessing. Anoint me to serve you in the name of Jesus. You and only you in the name of Jesus. Marco Sheta I pray for my family that my children will serve you. My generations will serve you in the name of Jesus. Everyone in this church will serve you in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus name. Amen. 14. Okay, 13. The glory of Lebanon will come to you. The juniper, the fir, and the cypress together Amen. to adorn my sanctuary. Amen. And I will glorify the place of my feet. The glory of Lebanon, the cedar of Lebanon, the, the glory of God will come to you. I decree and declare Amen. that the glory of Lebanon will fall on you. Amen. I said the glory of Lebanon will fall on you. Amen. After now, your life will come together. Amen. All the things that are missing in your life, receive restoration. Amen. I say receive restoration. Amen. I say receive restoration. Amen. To adorn the glory of God. Amen. Receive restoration. Amen. To adorn the glory of God. Amen. How do you adorn the glory of God? Uh -huh. When you come. Uh -huh. What men said about you, when they see you now, you exude. Yes, Hallelujah. Lord. The glory of God. Yes, Lord. Receive that grace. Amen. After now. I say receive that grace. Amen. After now. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Because of you. God will be glorified. Amen. I say because of you. God will be glorified. Amen. Someone will say. Eh, this is the hallelujah. Glory to God. Because of her. Yes. I'm going to church. Yes. Because of him, yes. I'm going to church. Yes. It will be your portion. Amen. I say it will be your portion. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 14. Aha. Uh -huh. It says the children of your oppressors will come bowing before you. Uh -huh. I decree and declare. Yes, Lord. The children of your oppressors uh -huh. will come bowing before you. Amen. I said the children of your oppressors yes, Lord. will come bowing before Amen. you. Amen. And all who despise you will bow down at your feet. Amen. I decree and declare I this receive. day that anyone who has despised you yes. all this while they will bow down at your feet. Amen. I said they will bow down at your feet. Amen. Why? Because you have made the Lord your banner. You have made the yes, Lord, Lord your pillar. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Receive that grace after now. Amen. I say receive that grace yes, after Lord. now in Amen. the name of Jesus. Amen. It says, and will call you the city of the Lord. Hallelujah. Raise up your right hand of fire. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. In this second half of 2022. Second half of 2022 make me a city. Make me a city. Make me a ah, city. Make me a city. Make me a city. Make me a city. Oh, open your mouth. Yeah. Open your Kutu, mouth. Kutu, Kutu, in the 
Magada 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 in Jesus' name. So shall it be in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Lord will make you a city. Amen. The Lord will make you a blessing. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. As God has made me a blessing over you, yes, Lord. God will also use you yes, as Lord. a blessing over somebody else. Amen. And, uh, to me too. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. You Amen. will be a blessing to me. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. A blessing to this grace. A blessing to the set man of this ministry. Amen. Set woman of this ministry. Amen. You'll be a blessing in his kingdom. Amen. I say you'll be a blessing. Don't find that blessing. Amen. Don't worry. Just walk yes. according to the will of God and the precepts of God. All of it will come to pass. Amen. Hallelujah. There's someone here. Yes. Your heart is earning for the work of God. You want to be writing checks, checks, checks for God, but yes. you, you are very not happy. You are not because it's not coming. It's coming to pass. Amen. I say it's coming to pass. Amen. I say it's coming to pass. Amen. The Lord will make you a city of Amen. himself. When God makes you a city, you understand city? Yes. Everything is in it. Oh. Yes. When they say this is a city, uh -huh. everything is there. Omega Fire Ministries, Aochi, uh -huh. is a city. Yes. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. When you go there, there is bank in the yard. There is bookstore in the yard. Yes. There is school. Hallelujah. Yes. Bible school in the yard. Yes. There is hotel. Yes. There, you see all the lists? Now we have gas. Uh, we have all of it. That is the blessing of God. Yes. He makes you a city. Now, unbelievers don't know this scripture. So when God starts making you a city, what is this? What is this? What? How should the spirit of God and the word of God manifest? It should manifest on trees or on animals. Isn't it human being? Yes. Who will manifest it for it? To come to pass. When we don't manifest it, the scriptures have lied. And when you don't manifest it, it's waste. The Bible is a waste. Hallelujah. Amen. Until you start manifesting it, then what? And Bible says his word never goes back to him void, but goes to accomplish a purpose. Yeah. That's why you need to be focused. Read your scriptures. Do not listen to all the nonsense going on. Only listen to what will take you to where you are going to. Amen. If you are studying to be a nurse and you are listening to a lawyer, you are wasting your time. Hallelujah. Amen. Vice versa. If you are studying to do law and you are listening to a plumber, how? Hallelujah. How? Am I talking to somebody? Am I talking to somebody? Be focused. Hallelujah. Today, if you don't carry anything home, remember that from now, this second half, you need to be focused to arise and what? Shine. Shine. In the name of Jesus. Amen. And it says, okay, all who despise you will come and what? Bow down yes. to you. Yes. I decree anyone who has despised you. Yes. Anyone Lord. who has despised your family. Yes, anyone Lord. who has despised anything that God has said concerning you. Yes, Lord. That you are trying your best in your own little way. Yes, Lord. But they keep despising. They keep undermining. They keep doing evil to you. Yes, Lord. They will come and bow down to you. Amen. I said they will come and bow down to Amen. you. Amen. I stand before God. And I kneel before the throne room of grace this day. Yes, Lord. That anyone who has despised you all this while will come and bow down to you. Amen. I said they will bow down to Amen. you. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 15. It says, although you have been forsaken and hated, with no one traveling through, I will make you the everlasting 
pride. Hallelujah. Raise up your right hand of fire. Yes, Lord. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Wherever I have been rejected. Wherever I have been rejected. Make me. Make me. The everlasting pride. The everlasting pride. Of that location. Of that location. Of that generation. Of that generation. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth my and pray. Father, my In father. the name of Jesus. Make me, oh Wherever. God, a generational pride. For my generation. For my location. Make me the pride. Wherever I have been rejected, wherever I have been rejected, make me a everlasting pride. Make me a showcase. Make me a showcase of wherever I have been rejected. In the name of Jesus, Marco shake it, 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 it. Leko shaka da da da. Rako she it, it, it. Ilegeza lega da lega da lega da lega da. Ilegeza lega da lega da. Ilegeza logo da logo da lega da lega da. Ilebeza I decree and declare. Yes, Lord. From the throne room perspective, uh -huh. wherever you have been rejected, yes. the Lord will make you a showcase. Amen. I say the Lord will make you a showcase. Amen. I say the Lord will make you a showcase. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be next. Amen. You will drink the milk of nations. Amen. See, we are not talking queer ah, here. We are not talking New York State. Oh, yes. We are not talking America. Yes. We are talking about what? Nations. nations. Hallelujah. You will drink the milk of nations Amen. and be nursed at royal breasts. Amen. Ah! Aha, 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 aha. Say, my father, my father, my father, my father, anoint me, anoint me to drink the milk of nations, to drink the milk and of nations, be nursed at royal breast. Open royal your breast. mouth and pray in the name of Jesus. Maka da 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 da. E rako so do do. Lege de lege de lege de lege de. Anoint me to drink the milk of nations. Anoint me to be nursed at royal breast. In the name of Jesus. The anointing to focus, to let it fall on me, so that I can be nursed at royal breast, so that I can drink the milk of nations in the name of Jesus. Anoint me, my father, my God, to focus. Anoint me, no matter. Hey, Mago, I need it. I need it. The grace to focus fall on me so I can drink the milk of nations and be nursed at royal breast. Hey, royal tables. Hey, Kabosha. You will walk with kings and queens. You will walk at the corridors of precedent in the name of Jesus. What God has said concerning your life will come to pass. I deep this prayer in the blood of Jesus and I block every retaliation of the enemy against this prayer in the name of Jesus. You will drink the milk of nations. It will be your portion. Whether the devil likes it or not, all you need to do is focus. All you need to do is focus. You don't serve a dead God. You serve a mighty God. He's the same yesterday. He's the same today. He's the same forever. When God says yes, no man can say no. When God lifts you up, no man can bring you down. God is on your side. Power is on your side. Favor is on your side. Drinking meals of nations is on your side. Open your mouth and pray. In the name of Jesus. In this second half, my father, my God, I will drink the milk of nations and I'll be nursed at royal breast. In Jesus' name. 
Amen. This is sweet. It says, then you will know that I, the Lord, am your Savior. Yes, Lord. Raise up your right hand. Uh -huh. Say, in this second half, in the second half of, 2022, of 2022, I shall arise, I shall arise and, shine. and shine. Say, I shall arise, I shall arise and, shine. and shine. Say, I shall arise, I shall arise and, shine. and shine. Say, I decree and declare, I decree and after, declare. Now, after now, I'm rising, I'm, rising. I'm, shining. I'm shining. Open your mouth, Le open your mouth in the name katu. of Jesus. This is very important. Uh -huh. There are people that walk under closed heavens. Hallelujah. You know, we have open heavens and closed heaven. The law of polarity, if there is open, that means there is what? Close. If there is left, that means there is what? Right. Praise the Lord. Yes. So it says, instead of bronze, I will bring you gold Amen. and silver in place of what? Iron. Iron. You see, uh, raise up your right hand. Of yes, fire. Lord. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. In this second half of 2022. In the second half of 2022. I decree, I and, decree declare and declare that my bronze. That's my bronze. Change to gold. Change to gold. Every bronze of mine in the name of Every Jesus, my of father, mine. let it change to gold. 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 Hey, let it change to gold. 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 Let it change to the Lord will change your silver yes, Lord. in place of iron. Amen. Hallelujah. Iron, do you know iron smells? Yes. Iron smells and it changes color. It rusts. But silver, when it's polished, is very nice. Yes. No wonder I'm wearing silver today. Glory to God. <laughs> Praise up your right hand on fire. Hallelujah. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Change every silver. Change every silver. Spiritual silver. Spiritual silver. In my life. Uh, la, um, uh, change every iron. Change every iron. Iron problems. Iron problems. Any pattern. Any pattern. Difficult issues. Difficult issues. Problems that I have prayed about. Problems that I have prayed all about. All this while. All this while. That is not changing. That is not changing. In this second half. In this second half. Oh God of heaven. Oh God of heaven. Let them be changed. 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 Every power of iron in my life, every situation that is like iron, that is the form of iron in my life. Let it be changed to silver. Let it be changed to silver. By your power, by your mercy, every iron be changed to silver. Be changed to silver. Be changed to silver. Be changed to silver. Every iron has to be compressed. Amen. Amen. Yes, Lord. We change every iron to silver. Every stubborn problem, wherever they are coming from, we change them to silver. Yes, Lord. Yes. Every weak situation. Yes. Mark us to silver. We change the stubborn situations. We change them to silver. Yeah, both. Let it change. 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 Yeah, ba 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 da 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 in our life, in Jesus' name. Amen. Ah, we can. It's, it's, it's a lot. Hallelujah. Amen. Say, Lord. Lord. Make peace. Make peace. My governor. My governor. When God makes peace your governor, uh -huh. you wake up in the morning, it's peace. In the afternoon, it's peace. In the evening, it's peace. Yes. Every time you exude what? Peace. peace. Uh -huh. Because 
peace is what is what ah. governing the person. Yes. So in this second half, in the second half, I beg of you. I beg of you. Make peace. Make peace. My governor. My governor. Peace in every area peace of my life. Peace in every life. area of my life. Open your mouth and katu, pray. Katu, katu, in the name of Jesus. Le kata shato ya. Le pusha kutu ya. Makata kutu ya. Le kutu ya no shata ya. Makatu ya no shata ya. Le katu ya da. Make peace, my governor. Peace in my home. Peace in ministry. Peace in business. Peace in my life and destiny. Peace in every area of my life. You have my permission this day. Make peace, my governor. Make peace. Give me a spirit of well-being. Make Let me be a ruler of well-being. In the name of Jesus. Let peace prevail around the world. Peace in the churches. Peace in our homes. Peace in our families. Peace at our workplaces. Let it be our portion. Peace academically. Peace. 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 The second half. Oh Lord, have your way. Have your way. Take control. Arise and let us shine. In Jesus' name. Amen. 18. We're going to eat communion. Praise the next time. Please let's take the mic. Amen. It says, No longer will violence be heard in your land. Say Amen. Amen. No ruin or destructions within your borders. Amen. Amen. But you will call your walls of salvation and your gates of praise. Amen. In this second month, yes. second term. Yes. No longer would violence be heard in your life. Amen. No ruin or destruction within your borders. Amen. You will call on the salvation of the Lord and he will answer you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. By divine instructions, I'm going to finish this. We have a few more to go. Yes. That will be your portion in the name of Jesus. Amen. Next. The sun will no more be your light by day. Amen. No, will the brightness of the moon shine on you? For the Lord will be your everlasting light. Amen. Ha! ha. What does that mean? Uh -huh. It means that even at night, you have light. light. You will not depend on the sun. Uh -huh. Receive it after now. Amen. I say receive it after now. Amen. And your God will be your glory. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Next. Next. Your sun will never set again. Amen. And your moon will wane no more. Amen. The Lord will be your everlasting light. Amen. May the Lord be your everlasting Amen. light. Amen. Your days of sorrow will end. Amen. I say your days of sorrow has ended. Amen. I say your days of sorrow has ended. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Now, please put one hand, your right hand on your head and Stand firm in the heavens. Another translation. Forever, O oh Lord, thy word is settled. That's the translation I'm going to say. Hallelujah. Yes. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Forever, O oh Lord, thy word is settled in heaven. Hallelujah. Yes. As we have prayed from Isaiah 60, verse 10 to 20, the word of God is settled in your life. Yes. I said, it is settled in your life. Yes. It says, forever, O oh Lord, thy word is settled in heaven. Yes. So shall it be as we have done it. It is settled in heaven. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Yes. This declaration, I want you to grab it, believe it, and it will go to work in the name of Jesus. Amen. This day, this moment. This day, this moment. No. This day, this moment. 
connecting to the grace over my father, Apostle Johnson Suleiman, standing in the throne room of grace, as the angelic host, stand before him that dwelleth between the seraphims and the seraphims. Hallelujah. Saying, holy, 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 you are Lord. I stand in the throne room of grace, and I decree and declare that after now, the glory of Lebanon is coming upon you. I say the glory of Lebanon is coming upon you. I say the glory of Lebanon is coming upon you. In the name of Jesus, I decree and declare that the word of the Lord after now is settled in your life. Amen. I say it's settled in your life. Amen. The devil has no chances on you anymore. After now, Amen. you are sealed and ready for the Lord in the name of Jesus. Amen. This day, this moment, I decree and declare that those that despised you and afflicted you shall call, come to you and bow before you. Amen. I say those that despise you and afflicted you shall come to you and bow before you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I decree and declare yes, Lord. that after now, you will be called the city of the Lord. Amen. I say you will be called the city of the Amen. Lord. I say you will be called the city of the Amen. Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I decree and declare in this second half, yes, after now, that you will be an answer, not a question. Amen. I say you will be an answer, not a question. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I decree and declare this second half of 2022 that the wealth of the Gentiles will be transferred to you. Amen. I say the wealth of the Gentiles will be transferred to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. This day, this moment, I decree and declare that your brass turns to gold. Amen. I say your brass turns to gold. Amen. Your iron turns into silver. Amen. Your wood turns into bronze. Amen. And your stars will begin to shine. Amen. I say your stars begin to shine. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I also decree and declare that peace will be your portion after now. Amen. Divine peace. Supernatural peace in your homes. Supernatural peace in your life and destiny. Amen. Supernatural peace in your ministry. Amen. Supernatural peace at your workplaces. Amen. Supernatural peace in your business. Supernatural peace on your academics. Amen. Peace in your health. Amen. Receive healing wherever you need Amen. healing. Receive healing wherever Amen. you need healing. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In this second half, uh -huh. I decree and declare yes, Lord. that the Lord shall be your everlasting pillar. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. The Lord will be your everlasting what? Pillar. Amen. If God be for you, who can be against you? I decree it that so shall it be Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Most importantly, uh -huh. in this second half, yes, Lord. according to Isaiah chapter 60, from verse 1 to 3, it says what? Arise, shine, for your light has come. I decree and declare this moment. After now, arise and shine. Amen. Arise and shine. Amen. Arise and shine. Amen. Arise and shine. Amen. I decree you are rising. Amen. I say you are rising. Amen. I say you are rising. Amen. After now, Amen. your shining is non-negotiable. I say your shining is not negotiable. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. the glory of the Lord begins right now to Amen. shine upon you. Amen. The Shekinah glory is locating someone. Amen. I say his glory is locating someone. Amen. After now, in the name of Jesus. Amen. I decree and declare the anointing that fell on Nehemiah to be very focused on his assignment 
fall on you. Amen. Let that anointing fall on you. Amen. I ask for the Nehemiah anointing to fall on you. Amen. This day, this moment. Amen. That nothing will waver your faith. Nothing will change your mind. Amen. That what God has said concerning you is what will come to pass. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I further decree yes, the anointing of Elisha uh -huh. fall upon you. Amen. That nothing will change you. No matter what you hear, yes, you will not be a nomad. Amen. A nomad moving from here to here to here to here. Yes, After now in the name of Jesus, Amen. you will find God in this place. Amen. And you will stay in one place so that your blessings will come to pass. Amen. The devil will not use you as a windshield. As a windshield, I break that windshield spirit of you. Amen. That you're going here, going there, going. Receive that the grace to break that windshield spirit of you in the Amen. name of Jesus. Amen. This day, this moment. Yes, Lord. Connecting to the grace upon my father, I Apostle Johnson Suleiman, yes, I decree and declare Amen. that you are blessed. Amen. I say you are blessed. Amen. You are blessed. Amen. You are highly favored. Amen. You are highly favored. Amen. You are arising. Amen. You are shining. Amen. Your rising is non-negotiable. Amen. No power from your foundation. After now, we'll have access to you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Be focused. Amen. Be focused. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. God bless everyone. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Let's give Hallelujah. a big hand of applause to Jesus. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. God bless everyone for coming. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank you for joining us. Hallelujah. This is Omega Fire Ministries, Bronx One. Um, we're here from 10 to 1. Praise the Lord. Join us next time. I hope you enjoyed today's sermon. God bless you. Our address is 2944 3rd Avenue, Bronx, New York, 10455. If you have a question, you can call 917-603-3202. Um, 917-603-3202. Thank you. My name is Pastor Rama. God bless. Bye. Amen. My time.